This is Secret Labs Magnus Metal Structure Gaming Desk. It is ultra slim, futuristic looking, with its floating looking design at the edge. Its texture is extremely soft as it is power coated. There's no rough edges. And surprisingly, everything is very modular. And when I first got this desk, assembling it for the first time literally only took me 30 minutes as everything was nicely labeled out and the assembly instructions were nicely thought out now there's two size choices to choose from you could go with either a 47 inch or a 59 the desk you see here is the 59 inch model and this one offers plenty of space which i think it's perfect for anybody who has an ultra wide monitor they want to put in their setup as you see i have plenty of space for not just my speakers but also two different computers both a mac and a windows and this tower is a mid-sized tower and there's still plenty of space for it now the width is 27.6 which from my experience is the right space to actually squeeze this desk through any doorway. Now the top texture, this is really unique. Secret Labs is calling this texture MagPad, which comes nicely rolled up and you simply just install like so. It has a very nice premium feel to it and it's basically a desk mat. It comes available in multiple different designs to choose from. Well, currently at the time making this video, there's three, but something tells me in the near future, just like their gaming chairs, expect to see some new additional designs get added. But this one's the one that you get by default. And right now there is a deal going on where this is a free add-on. Now overall, once this desk was fully assembled, I'm actually very surprised how well thought out this desk is. The engineers over at Secret Labs really did took a lot of time and effort in designing it as everything is basically almost perfected. Like a fine example, yes, the chassis is made out of metal, which is labeled to be able to support up to 220 pounds, which means you could put on a oversized monitor on this desk if you really want to you can or put two computers on the desk as well like i'm doing right now and even with this payload the desk is extremely sturdy now a unique feature that i wasn't expecting to find is that the legs are fully adjustable which means you could adjust the height of the desk up to 20 meters millimeters so you can find the right height that will give you enough space for your legs while you're gaming or using this desk for productivity use. If you may have noticed, my setup is primarily focused on content creating, which is why I have wireless peripherals, but I do have my tower there if I wanna test out a game or just have fun. So that's why my setup looks like this. And after doing a couple of projects, finishing a couple of tasks on my computers, I have plenty of space to rest my elbows comfortably on my chair while still being able to reach the mouse and keyboard. Heck, I even have plenty of space still if I wanna fully extend my legs and rest my legs on my desk to just stretch out and chill. Now in the back here, a unique feature I found very useful actually is that this back part over here actually opens up. Which caution, you try not to get your fingers stuck, but the gap is big enough that you can open it on the edges while also having enough space to run a bunch of cables if needed. And once you're done organizing everything, you simply just close it and hides everything. Honestly, the cable management system in, built into this desk is one of the best wire management systems available in the market. And this gap right here is big enough that you can actually put a custom monitor mount in there as well, as they labeled right here. So I'm probably gonna go ahead and do that in the future. Now, yes, I do have to admit, I could have done a better job with the wire management, but bear with me, this is only temporary as I'm about to be moving pretty soon to a new household. So this will do for now. I'm sure I could get the wire management to look extremely good. Now the desk, by default, they did came included with Secret Lab label Velcro straps for wire management. So you're basically set up from the start, but you could add more if you like to upon checkout. Now I really do like this little hidden doorway compartment, which you could take off magnetically and will give you access to your surge protector. So if you need to add more stuff in the near future, there's easy access right here as well. Now there's additional attachments you could add when you're checking out. When configuring your Secret Lab Magnus metal structure desk, there's these cool magnetic wire management attachments, which will hold any cable in place. Right now, as you see how I have my setup currently set up, is I have one of them holding my wireless G charger in place so it doesn't move around. The cable stays nice and tight. I also have it on my Razer RGB mouse pad, 
so it also stays in place but you can also use this to tighten any other cables that you have laying around on your desk like if you have a cable that connects to your cell phone to charge you can also do that as there's a nice little gap on the side of the edges on the edges where you can actually fit cables as well through there and you can literally connect it like this i'm telling you everything was really well thought out when designing and engineering this desk and then there's also additional attachments you could also add like these little magnetic leg covers which allows you to run cables down the legs and just hide them with this nice cover as everything on this desk is literally modular and then if you want to you can also add rgb lights as secret lab does have optional rgb lights they add with this magnetic led strip it gets powered by a single usb a port and can be controlled with this remote which has a bunch of different modes to choose from you could go do either solid colors breathe or this rgb color wave that i have right now at night this looks absolutely fantastic and gives you a very futuristic look perfect for any gaming setup really and then there's also more attachments soon to be coming out like this headphone mount which magnetically just attaches on any corner of the desk and is strong enough to even withstand the heaviest headphones available in the market like the airpod max as a fine example it has plenty of strength to make sure the headphone stays in place and doesn't easily fall off as it does take a little bit of force to remove all in all this desk is absolutely amazing and i think it's fairly priced as the smallest desk option can be had for 399 dollars and the larger 60 inch model is 450. even with this payload on my desk if i shake it there's no squeaky sounds whatsoever and feels extremely premium all in all i'm really impressed with this gaming desk i really don't have any complaints and no, this was not a sponsored video, but Secret Lab did provide me this desk ahead of time for me to actually get a feel for it and review it like a normal consumer. And no, I didn't have a script or anything like that. They didn't request me to say anything. I'm free to nitpick if I want to, but really, there really isn't much to really complain about. I mean, I guess there's one thing I could really nitpick about is the fact that the side edges over here, there's no cover covering these things. So these edges are always gonna be exposed, but it's great if you need to run cables down but it would have been nice if they came with like some type of cover I could place there as well if they're not in use. But this is just me trying to nitpick because when you're walking by standing up, you really don't see it unless you go down to the ground. So it's not that obvious. Oh no, that is the overview and review of Secret Lab's Magnus Metal Desk. This thing is absolutely amazing. I'm really impressed how well thought out the cable management system is for all purposes. I just like the fact that it hides all the cables very well. Literally the only cable you see hanging out is the cable that powers it all and connects to the surge protector, which is perfectly fine. And I also like the fact that the logos don't really like scream out a lot. Everything is nice and low key, minimum, perfect to fit inside any setup. So if you're interested in picking one up, make sure you use the link in the video description down below. As it is an affiliate link, it'll help me out, allow me to continue making videos like this without accepting sponsorships so I can continue being straightforward with you guys and review products as it is. So if you can, use that affiliate link, which will automatically always be updated to the latest deals and sales. If you got some good really useful information out of this video, I'll greatly appreciate if you could actually leave this video a like, as those help me out a lot, as well as get subscribed, as I basically cover a lot of tech videos I'm very similar to this. If you'd like to see more, check out this video over here as I review my one year ownership with the Secret Lab share covering all the wear and tear and stuff that happened upon ownership. And then that video over there, that has another Secret Lab share. That one is just us comparing the two different materials against one another to find out which one's the best one for you. Thanks so much for watching. Take care and I'll catch you all in the next one. See ya.